Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome, guys. Happy Monday. We're just going to jump right in, guys. What's in your energy space right now? space right now right for the collective guys every reading will not resonate right but take it as you see fit you have the crown chakra upgrade this is divine connection so you are connected directly with spirit right now like you connected y'all like this it's like that's your boy right you that's your purpose and then you're gonna ex have holy experiences and miraculous energy for some strange reason, you're going to upgrade. You're connected with spirit right now. You're going to have more holy experiences, probably like angel numbers, signs, um, downloads from spirit, and your energy is just going to be miraculous. Like, it's just, you're in, a, you're in a place, I guess it's time for you to spread your wings. You're going to spread your wings, but your crown chakra is being upgraded right now. You know how basically when you get an upgrade on your phone, like with Apple or something like that, and then they upgrade overnight or something like that, you're being upgraded right now with spirit. So that's a good thing. All right, guys, let's see what's going on. Let's dig a little deeper, shall we? Let's dig a little deeper, shall we? What is going on and with who? But right now, you are connected to spirit, so you are in a good space. Regardless of what's going on for you, you're in a good space. Holy Spirit, for the collective. What is crowning your reading, right? What is your current situation? What is crowning this reading, Spirit? Let's see. Seven of Pentacles. Work and patience, right? Work and patience. Good moves is coming in financially. Your money's looking good, right? So you could be working really, really hard. Whoever I'm talking to, you're working really, really hard. You've been very, very patient, extremely patient right now. Um, hold on to your money. You're watching your rewards come in, right? You're watching your rewards come in. You could also be healing from something. So you're definitely focused on your work and healing at the same time. That could be your crown chakra being upgraded while you heal. Let me see what's going on. Someone's not emotionally satisfied. Um, when it comes to your work, you're good there. When it comes to your money, you're good there. When it comes to your heart, you're not happy. You're healing from something. Uh, you're disconnected. You're not emotionally. You're not fulfilled emotionally when it comes to love, right? Could be fulfilled when it comes to work, not for love. You definitely have something in your head. You're thinking about something. Could be thinking about work. Could be thinking about dating. Could be thinking about you're juggling two things. You could be juggling a lot of things. You could be working two, three jobs while thinking about this and that, right? But you're doing a lot. In different areas of your life right now one of them you're definitely being busy and you're definitely meditating right and then you're unhappy that's a lot of emotion right there because when you're at work you're doing good you're happy when you go home you're laying down and then you're just not happy but you're juggling something there's something out there someone that you want to celebrate with or you want to go have drinks with maybe you want to go talk to hang out with a friend so something's on your mind right Holy Spirit, what's going on? I have a Queen of Swords here. This is a very perceptive person, if this is you, right? Very efficient. This person here is no nonsense, right? So there's no new beginnings here. Maybe they feel there's no new beginnings with this Queen of Swords here. Somebody who doesn't play. 
because this person here is no nonsense. It is a feminine energy. They maybe they just know this person don't play. Yeah, they're swimming away to come water. Somebody's swimming away to come water. This person here is gonna be swimming away to come water. It's like you're just busy working, but you're not happy. You're juggling your life or whatever. But whoever hurt you here to the point where you had to heal, they're not gonna get another chance with you. You said there's no new beginnings here and you're moving on because you're not fulfilled emotionally. You're just not. So you keep yourself busy working and then because you're so perceptive, you think things through. And I guess after you thought things through while you was healing, you're like, you know what, it's best that I leave. So someone's leaving, they're swimming away to come waters. And they want balance in their life, guys. This person here, they want an equal give and take. They don't want to be used and abused. They want to be able to have enough to give to other people to share, right? And to have things given back to them. They don't want to be the only one given in a situation. Whether it's at work, at home, if, you know, anything, whatever. Hierophant. They do. It looks like they do want to be in some type of connection, though. This Hierophant is surrounded by the Three of Cups and the um, Six of Pentacles. So they do want to be in a connection. It's just that they recently got out of one. And it's hard sometimes to get jump right back into a relationship. It's like you gotta dust it off. I don't know. Yeah, they, they ended something. It's the Ten of Cups in reverse. They really was not happy. Now somebody's frustrated because of the ending. Someone's frustrated because of the ending, but they're following their intuition. This person here, whoever this is, you're doing what's best for you. You're doing what's best for you. You're tired of arguing. You're tired of fighting. Whatever it was for you, right? You don't want this. No new beginnings. You're not going to do this again to yourself, right? You said it twice with the food card in reverse and the ace of wands in reverse. It's like you don't have any passion. You're not fulfilled anymore with this person. They don't do it for you. They don't do it for you. And that's your crown chakra upgrade. That's what it is. That's what it is. You, you run it through. Mm -mm. Nope, nope, nope. You got new love coming in. Somebody, whoever this person is here that wants to celebrate the Hierophant and then the Page of Cups, someone's going to offer you, you're going to have a new love offer coming in from somewhere. I don't see a person here, but a new love offer is coming in. Holy Spirit. Who is this page of cups? Who has this new love offer for the collective? Right? <laughs> Death card in reverse. Somebody you walked away from and they're in their Knight of Wands energy. So whoever it is, guys, this person, you've been together before, whether you was dating, whether you was friends, it's somebody you know, but you're not talking to them right now. They're going to try to come back and they're going to rush in. So somebody's trying to come back. That person, they want new love with you. I don't know. Yeah, they're not up in their head about it. So whoever this is, they thought about it. They see you as the Nine of Pentacles. They see you as being very abundant. Make sure that's not why they're rushing back in, right? Let's get one from Spirit about this whole connection. Because it looks like you're, you're definitely walking away from something. Uh, you don't want it anymore. There's no new beginnings here. But somebody wants to celebrate with you over here. This could either be you or your person, right? Holy Spirit, feel free to put the energy. Thank you, Spirit. Life Review. Archangel Jeremiah. Take inventory of your life and resolve to change or heal anything that is unbalanced. And that's this. And you're healing it because you're leaving it. Something's unbalanced, guys, and you're going to heal it. But then also, someone's coming in. Do we trust it? Can we trust it? Holy Spirit. Who is this Knight of Wands rushing back in for the collective? And why? So 
Because they cut off communication with someone else. Is that this person? Your person. They left somebody and they coming back to you. They want you for whatever reason, right? What are they bringing back? What do they want? Why is this Knight of Wands rushing back to me? Because they ended something. They're cutting communication with something. Something in their world ended, right? A connection. It's over. Don't end it for them. Yeah, page of swords in reverse. Now they know what they want to do. They still up in their head, though. They have a decision to make. Ace of Cups in reverse. Guys, this person coming in, they don't even know if they love you or not. They don't even know if they love you or not. So guess what? When they do come a knocking, you're going you're gonna to do a block in, okay? Because this person is coming in. Yes, they're getting spanked by life. Yes, they are, right? And you know this person. And y'all probably had a good time back then, back when, right? But now they're coming back. Are they coming back because they're lonely? Are they coming back because they don't have nobody? Are they coming back because you're a nice person? But see, you change. You're the queen of swords now. You're very perceptive. You may not take this one back. You're also the nine of pentacles. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Don't forget. This is a crown chakra upgrade. This could be spirit working on you to see if you if you take the bait. I don't know because this person isn't coming back with any love in their heart. It's the Ace of Cups in reverse. There's no love there. I don't know. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.